Okay, you inoculated your grain jar. Now practice your patience and wait because it is happy in these jars because it is sterile. It's not fighting against contamination in the jar. So pull in close. And this one was inoculated um, probably tw about 20 days ago. So you can see, um, you know, some thick patches of mycelium here. It's throughout, I hope you can see it. You know, look there where it's just reaching out, looking for other um, grain and mycelium it can attach to. So this one was inoculated uh, six weeks ago. I shook it and so waiting for it to, you can see there's white on just about everything. You'd be okay to go ahead and transfer this, but why? Because once you transfer it into the fruiting chamber, there will be some contamination because that's not sterile. You pasteurized it. This is sterile. So let it get robust in here. Let me show you what that looks like. Look at all that. So in some places you can barely even see the grain because that mycelium is so thick. So in the next video, we will show you how to transfer, transfer fully colonized spawn into your fruiting chamber. Oh boy, oh boy.